little story that you were telling about how all of your training had clicked until that last throw. There's going to be a lot of young young athletes as well that will feel probably like they're where's their training going? It's not amounting to something. I'm just really struggling yeah. to see that that progress. So I just feel like that that little message in there is actually really important to not to to trust that your training and what you're doing will yeah. get you somewhere. You just can't tell when it's going to happen. Yeah. So it's like I, I think of it this way: like you have this bucket. And you work to fill your bucket. And then whatever you have in your bucket on the day of competition, that's what you get to use. Mm. So sometimes you go to a meet and you only have like a couple of drops of water because you didn't do that much work, right? So for these competitions, I, I, I wasn't really focused on all the competitions. I knew that I had one big one that I want to get ready for. So I'm trying to put as many drops of water in this bucket. I'm trying to have this bucket filled and overflowing. So I have more than enough that I need for the day of competition. Hmm. And so, uh, so that's how I think about it. I do all the things that I could do. I leave no doubt in my mind that I could have done more than what I did. Yeah, I want to check all the things. I want to have everything done. So when I go to this competition, like I am overflowing with everything that I need because I put in the work, I put in the time, I put in the effort. Mm. 